tribute to Finn in the form of 10 interesting facts you may not know. Let's get into it. Fact number one, born in the Bronx and raised in the Washington Heights section of Manhattan, Vin Scully's father passed away when he was only four years old. Fact number two, in high school, Vin Scully worked a series of odd jobs, including as a beer delivery boy. Fact number three, after graduating high school, he spent two years in the Navy before he went off to Fordham University, where he served in a barbershop quartet called the Four Shaving Mugs. Fact number four, while at Fordham, the young left-hander patrolled center field for the Fordham Rams baseball team. Fact number five, after college, Scully sent 150 letters to radio stations up and down the eastern seaboard asking for employment. He received one response from an affiliate in Washington, D.C., which hired him as a fill-in. Fact number six, as luck would have it, legendary Dodgers broadcaster Red Barber heard one of Scully's games as a fill-in and brought the 22-year-old Scully over to the Dodgers organization. Fact number seven, Scully came west to Los Angeles with the Dodgers where they initially played their home games in the cavernous L.A. Memorial Coliseum. The stadium was so expansive, many fans couldn't see the game and took to bringing transistor radios to the game to listen to Vin Scully, and thus, Los Angeles' love affair with Vin Scully was born. Fact number eight, in 1964, the New York Yankees approached Vin Scully to become their head broadcaster, an offer which he thankfully turned down. Fact number nine, Vin Scully was a bona fide L.A. icon, including hosting the Tournament of Roses Parade in 1967, hosting the NBC game show It Takes Two in 1969. He had his own show, The Vin Scully Show, in 1973, and hosted the primetime Challenge of the Sexes in 1977. Fact number 10, this moving tribute at Oracle Park in San Francisco was poetic, not just because that's the site of where Vin broadcast his last game, but the team that Vin Scully rooted for while growing up was, you guessed it, the Giants. All right, LA, that's 10 facts about Vin Scully, the voice of Los Angeles. It's been a minute. Want to thank Evan Lomat from LA in a minute, and keep in mind, you can always check him out on Instagram, okay? Not someone that needs no introduction.